Hello friends, Satyendra here and in this video, let's remove the weld from any one of the view. So sometime when you have multiple views in your drawing, you may need to keep the weld in one view and remove the weld from another view. So here I have this exploded view in my drawing. So when this view is not exploded, The welds looks absolutely fine, but when I explode it, the welds moves here and there, which does not look good and that is why I want to hide these welds in this particular view. So this is my requirement. Now let us understand everything from the beginning and for this first we will see the assembly. So this is my assembly and I have added couple of welds here. So let us start from the beginning and for that first I will delete these welds and I will recreate it. And for this go to application, welding. Now here I will create the fillet weld. So I will go to the fillet weld, location. For first location I will select this surface. And for second location, I will select this surface. I will take size as 10, I will go to the options and here I will select solid. I will say OK and my fillet is done. Similarly, one more time, I will go to the fillet weld, location. For first location, I will select this surface. For second location, I will select this surface. I will make it solid and size again I will take 10 and I will say OK. So, I have created two welds here. I will move these welds above the offset line. Now, I will go to the drawing. Now, here you first go to annotate, show model annotation, symbol and add the welding symbols just like this. Now, you can rearrange your welding symbols. Now, my requirement is to hide this weld from this particular view and for this the easiest way is first you go to layer tree, scroll down, right click and send new layer. The layer name I will take as weld and I will select these welds in this layer just like this. So, I have selected these two welds in this layer, I will say OK. Now, to hide it, I will directly go to this layer, I will right click and I will say hide. But now, if you closely observe this, you will see that the weld from all the views has gone. So, this is not my requirement. So, bring it back and for this once again I will right click and I will say so. Now, to hide this weld from this particular view, go to this arrow and select this view first and then follow the same procedure which we have just followed. So, right click and say hide. So, this time you can clearly see that the weld from the exploded view has gone but the weld in other two views are still there. So, this was my requirement and it is nicely done and the same procedure can be followed to hide several other things. Now, the procedure which I have just followed to manage these layers, if you want to learn this procedure in depth, then I have a separate dedicated video which is drawing layer management. Here you will understand the importance of this arrow, the use of this drop down list and several other things. To manage the drawing layer, the link is given below in the description area and it will also come at the end of this video. So, watch this video to understand the drawing layer management in depth and that is it from this video. So, this was the complete procedure to remove the weld from one view and keep the weld in other views and I hope this video will be helpful. Now, you can like this video if you find this video helpful and I will see you in my next video. Thank you.